Looking for an easy dessert recipe to make without oven? Try Ibiza tatlısı. This Turkish pudding dessert with chocolate pudding and whipped cream layers is popular in Turkey in cafes and patisseries and easy to make at home. For the chocolate pudding, I have 1 plus 4 of a cup flour, 3 fourth of a cup sugar, 2 heaped tablespoons cocoa powder. It is better to sift if it has some lumps. Give it a stir first before adding 1 liter of whole milk. To be able to whisk everything well, I add half of it first and then add the rest. I turned on the heat and going to cook until it is thickened and bubbly. Meanwhile, I'm gonna process my biscuits. I have two package. These are oat biscuits. And you can use similar ones you have or a graham cracker for a cheesecake. Edit about half tablespoon butter and going to process. The butter will help to stick the mixture together. To my chocolate pudding I'm adding vanilla pots. These are ready. It's a gift from my follower from Australia. You can use vanilla extract if you are already using or as we do in Turkey, use vanilla powder. I'm using a big baking tray. It is important to use big so the thickness will be same. Make sure to butter. It will help to stick the cookie crumbs. My pudding is almost done. My daughter Zeynep is whisking for me. I added a bit of butter and about 100 grams of chocolate chips. So first the cookie crumbs. We have to cover the whole tray evenly. I used a spatula first to spread and press and then change it to a glass. Here my daughter Zeynep was asking how it's gonna stay like this because it's just a cookie crumb. And I said that uh, the pudding will help to dampen the cookie crumbs and also the butter we added will help and it will stay. Next drizzle the chocolate pudding all over the crumbs. If you have an offset spatula like this, it will help to spread easily. Then we have to wait at least 3-4 hours or even overnight is better before shaping. For the whipped cream layer of our Ibiza dessert, I have 1 cup cold milk, adding 2 packages of cream chantilly powder, 
This is what we use for making whipped cream in Turkey. You can use however you make like whipping heavy cream as I know from the USA. You can also give your comments how you make your whipped cream so it will be helpful when I make the other videos. The whipped cream should be thick so I used two packages. In some recipes they also melt white chocolate into the heavy cream and after chilling add it to the whipped cream that's another option to make it more richer another hint is it is better to chill at least for an hour after spreading the heavy cream or you can do both the day before so it will be chilled completely before rolling I cut it into eight pieces it was a big a huge serving size if you want you can also cut it into 12 even sizes I'm gonna show you two techniques on rolling first simply I wanted to try with a spatula it was okay but the top of the dessert comes out not so evenly because I have to hold it with my fingers if you don't mind that it's okay it's not gonna affect the taste In the next method, I have piece of baking paper ready and with two spatulas I'm transferring the rectangular piece I cut. Again cutting from the sides, place the banana piece and this time with the help of the baking paper just roll. As you can see it was easier to roll and also you got nice coating but the chocolate layer was sticking a little bit from the sides but still it's okay which one would you prefer what do you think silky smooth chocolate pudding whipped cream and cookie crumbs it is really mouth watering and delightful so i hope you give it a try and enjoy it i have similar dessert recipes from turkish cuisine to try check the links down below and my channel and don't forget to subscribe for more and stay tuned Thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time. Afiyet olsun.